I was at Woolwich and I realised I didn't do any non-spoiler review for yesterday. And I really thought I did, and the problem is I can't remember much of the film. But that being said, let's get started. Um, I did really enjoy the film, so I was like I hated it, I just can't remember quite a bit what happened. I remember most of it, because um, it was about a week ago today I watched it, um, not yesterday. That would have been convenient, that would have been cool to have done that. Um, if I did the review, the review on a Sunday, but today I did the review, review for Spider Man Far From Home. I was going to do that first, now that it's fresh in my memory, fresh in my mind, but you know, I want to do it in the order that I watched them in. So, yesterday, if you're not a Beatles fan, probably don't watch it. Um, if you know some of their songs, probably, but the actor in it, I think it's from a soap, British one, but I don't know which one he's from. I believe he is. And I thought it was really, really great in the film, singing the Beatles songs, you know. And I thought the story was really, really unique and um, a little bit predictable, not going to lie. Uh, I've been saying that quite often. Um, but I did think overall it was a really, really good film, you know. Um, there was a few twists and turns, you know, you know, wasn't really expecting for them to do in the film. And I think the casting was really, really great. Um... There isn't really much to say on a non-spoiler basis. I'm never going to do a spoiler review for this film. Um, but it had her from Ghostbusters. I don't think she was a great character. You know, she's a bit all over the place. But I think there's a couple of decisions I would like to see different in the film. And the scene how they would have played out. Um, and I just think overall it was a really, really enjoyable movie. And it feel like, you know, you had to focus loads on it. There was like a big law, it's not sort of like an MCU film. It's just a movie on its own, and that's what I really, really like about it. It does what it's trying to do very, very well. And there's not a lot of complaints I've got about it. There's just not too much to say about it in a non-spoiler type of way. It had to have Mamma Mia too. She was very, very good in it. She was being like the girlfriend at the end. It kind of sounds kind of a spoiler, sorry about that. Um, that's just a point I'll be mentioning though. Um, I don't really know if it's really a spoiler. Um, but I think it was quite a satisfying ending. Ed Sheeran was in it. That was quite cool. Um, and I just think overall it was a very, very good film. Just not a whole lot to say about it. But soon, maybe tomorrow, um, and going somewhere tomorrow, so I might not be able to. Um, I think it will be back on day, able to do a video then. Um, maybe for Spider-Man 1. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, leave a like subscribe, and comment. Let me know if you've seen your state and what your favourite Beatles song is. Um, I don't really have a favourite. Um, I try to think of one for this video, but, but I, I can't really think of one that's my favourite. Um, I don't really know. But um, anyway, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys soon, if I haven't said already. Um, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. I think I've already said that. But um, I'll do another video for Spider-Man Far From Home shortly. I don't know when, but hopefully shortly. And thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys soon. Ciao.